I think internally as well, there's been a big kind of learning curve um, as an organisation. We grew very quickly because of the funding that came in from the national government. So we kind of have tripled the size of the business in the space of about six months. And when we're kind of thinking around co-production and a big part of that, the work that we did win was to try and um, really engage communities in different ways and to do, you know, do more of that co-productive work. Um, but one of the challenges internally has been how to kind of scale that and how to make it the process and or to have the processes to implement those kind of co-production practices more on a on a larger scale especially when we're working in new areas um that we might not have been had well definitely there's new areas that we haven't um worked in at all before so how you even as an organization build trust with those communities and and add that as an area um is tricky but then also kind of internally creating the processes and, and rolling out those processes and again testing and learning those processes as we go and iterating to make sure um, we are really kind of working as well as we can and trying to really work towards that definition of co-production, but also being quite conscious of the fact that we might not get there every single time.